Yum, yum. William Vaughn here with a quick look at setting up a Puppet controller using ChannelChimp for Moto and the Touch OSC editor and app. Start with a mesh item that contains four more vertex maps. Open the Touch OSC editor and add an XY pad by right clicking and choosing XY pad. Adjust the scale and placement to your liking and change its value range to negative one to one and choose a color. Save and sync the new layout to your device and launch ChannelChimp. Activate the auto add feature and push the XY pad on your device to add a new channel to ChannelChimp. This channel will receive its values from the X position of the pad. Give the new channel a chimp ID. I'll call this one Control X. Stop the live sync and manually add a new channel. This channel will receive its values from the Y position of the pad. Click Learn and push the XY pad on your device. Disable Learn and change the field slider to 2. Toggle the Remap Values option and swap the values for the output fields. Give the new channel a chimp ID. I'll call this one Control Y. In Moto, create morph influences for all four morphs. I'll use the quick morph influence command in the hatchet collection to speed up the process. With all four morph influences selected, add the strength channel to the schematic view. Drag the provided XY morph pad assembly into the schematic and connect the outputs to the morphs. Select the assembly and open the channels tab. Right click on input X, choose connect to chimp and choose control X. Right click on input Y, choose connect to chimp and choose control Y. Push play and start using the XY pad on your device. Create as many controllers as you'd like and enjoy animating. Oh, look at the time.